So I'm sure you know that blood is pretty important, right? I mean, if you see that someone has lost a lot of blood, it's not usually a good sign. But why? What is so important about blood? Well, in the next few videos, we will show you just how special this incredible red liquid is. Your blood is made up of plasma, red blood cells, white blood cells, and platelets. In this video, we will look at the red blood cell. These are also known as erythrocytes. And you have a lot of them. In fact, in just one drop of blood, there are about 5 million red blood cells. They only live for 120 days in your bloodstream, and every second, your body makes 2.5 million new red blood cells to replace old, dead cells. Okay, I hear you say, that's great. We have lots of these cells, but what do they actually do? Well, they have one very important function, and that is to transport oxygen around the body. Every cell in the body needs oxygen in order to carry out aerobic respiration and release energy. We take oxygen into our lungs every time we inhale, but something has to pick up that oxygen and carry it to all the other cells in the body. And that is the job of your red blood cells. And you know what? They do a very good job of it. And that's because they have all the special adaptations needed to carry out this very important role. Firstly, they have a biconcave disc shape. This basically means that they look like a jam donut that has been squashed in the middle. This gives them a large surface area to absorb oxygen very quickly. Another adaptation is that they have no nucleus. Think about it. There would be no use in a red blood cell taking up extra space with a large nucleus when it could use that space to carry even more oxygen. An amazing adaptation. But the best adaptation of all is that they contain the transport protein, haemoglobin. In the lungs, it binds with oxygen to become oxyhemoglobin. As the red blood cells travel around the body, they release this oxygen from the oxyhemoglobin to the respiring tissues. But there is more. Oxyhemoglobin is also what gives the characteristic red colour to the blood cells you can see that red blood cells are very special cells. Did you know one of the world's biggest killers, the malaria parasite, invades and destroys blood cells, and that's why it's such a serious disease to get. And yet, although they are so important, red blood cells make up just one part of your blood. Of course, we've got more lessons for you on the other parts. A quick question to see if you've been paying attention. How many red blood cells has your body made during the last two minutes of this video? Pause the video now while you work it out and click play when you're ready for the answer. The answer is 300 million cells. Give yourself a pat on the back because that's a lot of cells. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Comment below if you have any questions. Why not check out our Fuseco app as well? Until next time.